Fifth Wing boss. Yep. Like promised. Let's read off what we've got. I have no idea what that is. No clue. We'll find out in a minute. Probably celery. Could be, yeah. Or carrots. Yeah, we got ranché, ranché. Mm -hmm. You get the gist of it. Yep, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Bless you. A lolly push. All right, again, because now you can read it. Mango habanero. We've got. Mm. Sweet red chili, a leaky bag, we're going to put that bad boy on the floor. And then we found somebody named Terry, <laughs> Teriyaki of course, we were complaining, well I was complaining about that last night. Yeah. Garlic Parmesan, which is the bucket chain's favorite. And final one and it seems to have leaked yeah it's, it's too bad. technical difficulties um, we might want to turn on our sign oh yeah okay. So, in the order of heatness, we're going to go quartz. Quartz. Yeah. Okay. So I need to grab it, so grab it. <laughs> Excuse me. So we're going to go garlic parm, teriyaki, actually, it should be teriyaki garlic parm, because ter uh, teriyaki yeah. doesn't have any heat. Garlic does if you use enough of it. You got garlic parm, or teriyaki garlic parm, sweet chili, Asian zing, mango habanero. And what we're going to do is we're going to cut it in half, because they are pretty big. We'll show you first. Yeah. You know, we're going to try it, obviously. We're going to rate that bad boy. Yum. And, uh, same as last night. Out of the five, which is your favorite? And then out of the five, each one rate it one through five. Five being the best, one being the worst. And let's see if Wing Boss can knock the hell out of the Wing Experience. It's going to happen, trust me. All right, so teriyaki. Oh, wow. They even put holes in the top of the box. I don't know if you For can see venting. that. Yes. Because of the steam. Now, let me show you a perfect example of their wings. That one's probably going to fall. Hang on one second. Yeah, because of the sauce. There you go. All right. Oh, God, that one's huge. Look how big that wing is. Sorry, it's still backwards for me. That's huge. Humongous. All right. Alright, so which one do you want me to cut? That one. Well, that one actually cut in half by itself. Yeah, that's how tender their wings are. Alright, so we're going to try them at the same time. Chuck that out. <laughs> mm. Oh my god. Now, mm. Mm -mm -mm. I love strong teriyaki flavor, and that's it. Oh my god. It's amazing. I oh. did forget to mention we have a surprise addition that uh, they're the only restaurant that I know that serves wings that does this. Clear the palate. Pinky up. 
because I'm proper. Now, since these are yours, I'm going to pick it up and I'm going to show it to them. Because they actually put... Garlic. Garlic. Looks like sesame seeds, but that's not. It's garlic. reason I'm not a huge fan of the garlic parmesan wings is because they have to use butter. Yeah. Yeah, I do. I love it. Now, again, those are good. Oh. Now we're getting into the heat in this ter territory. I've not had the sweet chili. Me either. That's what we're doing now. So. Mm. I might have that backwards, but look at that. that That's good. sweet chili, baby. Uh, it's amazing. That is good. Is it? Nice. I only got a little bit on the fork. Alright. I'm going to get a little bit extra in there. Hang on one second. Okay. Dink it. Boop. Sink it. There it is. Oh my god. Now, oh. it's the chilies mm -hmm. in the, in the uh, sweet red chili. It's got sweet, and then it knocks you flat on your butt. Oh god. Oh. Oh, I'm turning red. Don't let, the, don't let it fool you. Mmm. Sorry, I'm watching myself. Oh, that is on fire. Holy cannoli. Woo. Yes, Allie. It's hot for Mama. All right. Now, you've had the Asian Zing, so I got those backwards. Mm, okay. Because I've never had that one before. But yeah. it doesn't last. Like, yeah. it's already going away, and I haven't had anything to drink. And it's not, it's not like having fire hot sauce, you know? Yeah, we're To where it hits you all over. And it hurts. Oh, my God. All right, oh. hold up. Wait a minute. Now, one thing I, th I think I should mention is these are breaded. Yes. So they do soak up the juice. This is Asian Zing. If only... You can taste that. You had smell vision Oh, my God, y'all. Yeah, Asian Zing is... Same thing. Oh, excuse me. Goodness. It's creeping back up. But bam. Yep. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh my god. I forgot. Those are backwards. I forgot. There is a it. tad bit of heat, but it is nowhere near what the sweet chili was. <laughs> Not like you think, because. Not all mango habanero sauce is the same. It depends on how they make it. If there's more mango and not as much hot sauce, then it's not as hot. Yeah. You can tell by the way it smells. It smells like mangoes. All right, so what we're going to do, we're going to pick a small one. Y'all, you get the uh, just of the idea of what they look like. Mango habanero. And I will do the honors on that. Oh. So I can give you a small piece. I'm not cutting it in half. Because I know she can't handle it. That's that little piece. And in comparison to mine, look at the size difference. Yeah. See that? Compared to my little baby. And one. that's hers. Baby.
sweet. It's really sweet, actually. It'll creep a little bit. Mm. <laughs> Like, I can't taste the heat. Oh, my God. I seriously can't taste the heat. Now, Buffalo Wild Wings version of that is you wouldn't be able to sniff it. Don't light your ass on fire? Yeah, that's not that hot. <gasps> now, in comparison, this is hotter than this. Well, my tongue didn't calm down from that one, so. So, that just intensified it. Yeah. And I'm serious, it's really not that hot. Like, I had a bigger piece and I sauced it up more. Alright. So. Oh, my throat. Oh, there goes my eyes. Yeah, my mouth is on fire from the sweet red. The, I will say the sweet red chili is burning the F out of my mouth right now. Holy hell. What's in those, um... Check those aluminum foil looking things. I have right. no idea what she put in So those. before we do that. Oh, we got to do the rating. We're going to rate them. <clears throat> I can see one person commented, and I think that was me starting the comments. Anyway, teriyaki. It had a good balance between sweet and... And, uh, well, I say sweet, but, it, you know, teriyaki, depending, has a little bit of sweetness, but it has a lot of saltiness. Yeah. Those were good. Garlic parm. We're okay. We're it's numbers. just not my thing. So, I'm just going down the list, and then I'm going to name them off. That's what we did last night. Gotcha. Okay. I love the Asian Zing. This is probably the third or fourth time I've had those. Yeah, those are your favorite. The sweet red chili, even though it has a lot more heat than the mango, <coughs> it was great. Actually, yeah, it did. Because the heat doesn't last. The mango, it does. But it be, compared between the two, the sweet red chili is a lot hotter. Yeah. It gets a lot hotter mm -hmm. a lot uh, quicker. Yeah. The mango is, is great because it's that sweet and then it's a slow creeper. Yeah. Did you notice that? It really it was. It did, yeah. It did it on the back of my tongue. It started on the back of my tongue and it moved up. And if you notice now, some of the heat should be dissipating. No. Slowly. Anyways. Teriyaki. Um, between teriyaki and mango, we're going to pick which one's our favorite. Which one's our least favorite, but yet still really good. And then we're going to rate each one. So... On that being said, Asian Zing for me is definitely number one. Mango Habanero, number two. The Sweet Red Chili, number three. Teriyaki, number four. Sorry, Garlic Lovers. Garlic Parmesan, number five. Now, Teriyaki on a one through five was probably a three. Garlic Parmesan, sorry, 1.5. Uh, Asian Zing, definitely a 4.6. The Sweet Red Chili, 4.4. And the Mango, 4.4. What says you? Oh, if my mouth is not on intensely fire like a burning butt hole. Anyway. Um, my... I actually, honest to God, I like all of them. Um... So for my favorite... Starting here, tell them what your description was and what it what it made you feel, whether you thought it was good or not. Yeah. And then, then pick your it. order, and then rate each one starting back down here and working with it. Gotcha. All right, so teriyaki, like he said, it does... I can see where my taste buds are a little bit more sensitive. I can actually taste a lot of salt in it. Um, I always could with teriyaki. Um... Teriyaki is actually really good, but I can taste the salt in it. Garlic parm, it's always been my fan favorite just because I'm obsessed with garlic. I probably sweat garlic and fart it and everything else. Um, the zing, I agree with him. Asian zing is like rock on. Um, it's got great flavor. The sweet red chili lit my mouth on fire. But it's got good flavor though. 
I like that. The mango, I did taste some of the mango, and like he said, with the heat though, or the hotness. The heatness. The heat, yeah, the heat. Trademarked, it, not really. Yeah, he, uh, the heatness crept up in the back of my throat, literally, and like came up, and I'm like, <sighs> like a dragon. <laughs> Felt like I was like breathing fire, but. The red chili was a, had more heat. All right, so which one was your favorite? Which one was your least favorite? Got to go with garlic parm. It's number one. It's a fave. That's always been my thing. Um, two is a zinc. Asian zinc. Um, three, I would put mango. Mango habanero. Four, actually, sweet red chili. And then teriyaki number five. Sorry. All right. One through five, starting with teriyaki, ending with mango. Teriyaki, I give it like a 1.9 for my rating, just because it was a lot of salt. Garlic parm, you got to know it's like a 4.9. Um, zing, I would put it at a 4. Sweet red chili, 4.8, just because it's got the heat and it's got good flavor. So we're going high on that one. Yeah, believe it or not, yeah. Um... Mango, habanero, I would do the same. 4.8. All right.